Pika! 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 So much going on in the studio. So I just finished my brand new line time class. Check it out on Fava TV on August 15th. It's so good. It's just so good. I'm not just saying it because it's me, but it's really good. And then I convinced John to sit in the chair and take advantage of this whole Pokemon thing. So I don't know about Pokemon. I just got the lowdown and we're gonna all get on our cell phones after this and go find all the Pokemon that seem to be existing within our plaza. So is just make sure you're following me on social media. Make sure you're following me on Facebook and on Twitter. I love Twitter, it's so good. And thanks again for joining me. I'm almost at 30,000, um, what are they called? Subscriptions on my YouTube channel. So help me get there. I'm like. Maybe 200 short, I don't even know. But thanks again for supporting me and tuning in. I will see you soon. I'm heading to Canada on Wednesday. So I will see you there at the Magic Mirror. All right, let's get started. Okay. okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> it's crazy popular. It's breaking the servers. It's so popular. What What is Pokemon? Pokemon Go? Don't know what it is. It's a new app that uh -oh. uh, Hold on. is an augmented reality. You walk around your own city and collect Pokemon at various landmarks. And just around, they could be in your office, they could be in your home, they could be in the street, they're everywhere. Okay. Sorry, I got really excited. Is so We're gonna start off by making this uh, Pokeball. And what does the Pokeball do? It captures Pokemon. It so you need it to capture Pokemon. Yes. All right, the thing is with this ball is that it's half white and half red. As you know, it's not that easy to paint white over or red over white or white over any color because uh, they tend to bleed in. So I would probably use a baby white to remove some of that, but that's okay. Then we're gonna use his optimum real estate, which happens to be this area. See, most kids don't have this much real estate. You do which makes it ideal for us. I have a large forehead is what she's trying to say. Exactly, exactly. Okay, so then I just use my fab. This is the bright yellow, love this yellow. Uh, using a big drop brush, love this brush. Good for, for creating nice and big, filling in nice larger areas. So right underneath um, my ball, I'm gonna make this half dome and then I'm just going to kind of fill it in right inside of there hope this comes out as good as I'm thinking about it in my head then I lay down my brush and I want it to get thinner um, from the base okay just like that then his other ear so I'm gonna come up then kind of round it out there as well so I'm just gonna make sure that there's that little dip in the ear as well. Then I'm just gonna come around his eye and fill it in. Now anytime that you're going to layer, so layer, I'm gonna, Pikachu's known for his little black points on his ears, so you gotta make sure that this is gonna be dry before you can layer. All right, another thing that Pokemon, or Pikachu, sorry, is known for is, Lightning. Red cheek, lightning. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, red cheeks. Okay, so we're creating that nice round shape right there to just frame his face. Then you can fill in. Now the cool thing is this brush is nice and wide. So if you wanted to do all of your work, line work, or filling in with this brush, it, it makes it relatively easy because you can cover in a large area. So I'll do half filling it in with a brush, half filling in, filling it in with a sponge. fast I did it using a, a brush that's the cool thing is that some of you who want to preserve a manicure yeah using this brush works for those of you that love sponging and trucker hands that's why you just pick up your sponge okay so So I told you I want to remove some of that. So I'm going to just spray a little bit of brush bath. This is my sample bottle, sorry, um, on my, doesn't matter, it doesn't hurt your eyes. Oh. On a paper towel, since I don't have any baby wipes, I use them all. Um, you can use this to remove the makeup from your skin. It's an all natural remover, so uh, you can use it. Don't stress yourself out. So I'm just going to go in and kind of get rid of some of the white pokey ball because we're going to fill that in with what I'm going to do is just trace this, just like this, half circle. So 
so you see how much better it looks like you want that red so you really want that red red you don't want it to be pink or muted or anything like that uh, since my brush is already loaded with red I'm just going to create those nice happy Pikachu cheeks. exactly so one two and then first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to trace uh, my pokeball and you want it to have a nice thick border just like that perfect all right so we started off with that pokeball right in the middle so now I'm going to come down on both sides because that's where his ears are I'm going to come out and I'm just going to brush out the edges so I brought it in just like that I'm going to bring those ears in and now using that same, I don't want to say fat line, but thick line. You want these to be thicker, bolder lines. I'm just bringing the whole thing in. You can either switch over to your little drop brush or your big drop brush again, either one. And you get those kind of eyebrows. So I'm going to go over his eyebrows. Oh, thank God. I love when I use wolf black on top of your eyebrows. Yeah, me too. <laughs> So then using the corner of the eyebrow, I'm just going to press and just come around so that you're, again, just, you're creating those eyebrows. Now the new, now the new 2.0 version of Pokemon has a much smaller nose than it used to. And the good thing is that you have a very s small tip of your nose, so it makes my life. So it's kind of like this little whatever it is. Most of my designs, I like to keep the mouth open for a reason, just so that they can talk, they can eat, they don't have a reason to come back to me to have to fix their lips. Now, lipstick is a different story, okay? You know that. Um, but with this, then I like to keep it open so that they don't have to. That's why I didn't go all the way down. Good, so. thank you. Oh, you didn't, you wanted lipstick? No. I could have done that. No. I I'm good, Chuck. Okay. I'm good. All right. So, you'll want to end this mask just right underneath there. So, we got to create the outline. We got to make it pop. Like, Pokemon is powerful, right? Like, that's the purpose of it. You're collecting powerful balls. No pun intended. I don't know. Did you just say powerful balls? Is that what you're supposed to be doing? No, you're collecting little, little animals. Okay, my bad. Somebody should be evicted from this conversation. We need a sensor. We need a sensor for me. Okay, so I'm going to fill this in. So now we're just going to add some white highlights all around the edge. So I'm just going to start outlining, giving my Pikachu another outline. Stop. His face is going to make me not paint well. Uh-oh, I'm running out of real estate, guys. Oh, uh, I need a bigger forehead? No, this is more to paint. Okay, mm. so I'm just outlining it again with yellow so that we can add that little pop. Well, anyways, <laughs> I lay it down and I just kind of just rub it out just like that. <laughs> so I'm adding these pops of the half tones right around there. For me, they just always add that extra touch that I like. All right, now normally I would smother him with glitter, but I won't do it today. Thank you. Oh, little on cheeks, little okay. on cheeks. Yes, yes, oh yes. So, mm, you know me, glitter. I would use a red, because the red would just like pop. And boy, a little bit there, there, just like that. All right, guys. So now you can see this fancy, dancy Pikachu. Um, you can should be able to get points for using this. Work, work, work. Work, 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 work. Okay, no, oh, sorry. none of that. Okay. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this Pokemon Super Pokeball Mon uh, tutorial using John. Thank you, of course, for letting me use your awesome face. As always, connect with me on social media. Find out where I'm going to be next. I look forward to seeing everybody in Canada next week at the Magic Mirror. We're doing a free jam. Free? Free. What? Free 99 on Thursday night. And then I have a workshop on Friday. So join me. If you have questions, comments, as always, leave feedback and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. Have a great day. Bye.